Thank you for joining us. I'm David Wade with this WBZ News update. Our top stories, a Wareham teenager who was hit by car riding his bike a week ago has died. Police say 14 year old Toby Alford was hit at the intersection of Sandwich and Narrows Road. He was taken to the hospital with a head injury but did not survive. The driver stayed at the scene and is cooperating with police. An Ashland woman and her daughter who were trapped in Sudan have escaped. A message from the woman's sister-in-law says the Trillian Clifford and her 18-month-old baby girl Alma left Sudan with other foreign nationals from the school where Clifford taught. It will be several days before they're expected to reach U.S. soil. And some people in central New Hampshire may have felt the ground shaking. The U.S. Geological Survey says just before 10 on Tuesday morning, a 2.9 magnitude quake hit near the town of Sandwich. Police received several calls about the tremor, but there are no reports of any damage. All right, let's get a check of the forecast now with Eric Fisher. Eric. All right, David, we'll be heading to tonight. We had a couple of showers around early, then just mostly cloudy skies and patchy fog as well. Cool night back down around 40 degrees. Any of the showers from earlier in the evening should be dissipating by about 9 or 10 o'clock. Tomorrow is kind of the opposite of today. We should have clouds early and then increasing sunshine heading toward midday in the afternoon. So it's kind of a backwards day, if you will, but mostly dry. A chance for an isolated shower late in the afternoon and the best shot would be toward Worcester County. Farther to the east, likely remaining dry. High temperatures in the 50s again. It's another cool one, seasonably so, especially near the coast. Upper 40s to low 50s if you're right near the water. Water. On Thursday, we're also in the 50s. Hard pressed to get some warm spring weather around here. Pattern is just kind of stuck and it's going to stay there for the most part. That said, Friday's looking like a good day. After a couple of showers on Thursday, Friday should have more sunshine, less wind, 60s for inland spots, 50s at the coastline. But David, Friday's the day to make some outdoor plants. All right, that sounds good. Eric Fisher, thank you so much. I'm David Wade. This has been a WBZ News update. We thank you for watching. Have a great night.